SMT Nation, we back with this video, Verizon Network Update. This one's pretty big. It's going to be pretty major. It's going to help out a lot of people for sure. And I know a lot of people have been looking forward to this 5G ultra wideband business. A lot of cities already have it. The build's getting pretty good. Uh, top 46 PAs type of thing. Now there's a handful of PAs which weren't initially in that top 46 batch. Now they're kind of in the fold. I'll explain. We got this update from Verizon. Dated today at the time of this recording, July 14, 2022. Link in the description. Verizon expands 5G ultra wideband service to more than 1 million more residents in Atlanta, Georgia. Now, just to get things going here, when they say ultra wideband, there's two things it could be. It could be millimeter wave, or it could be the N77, the mid-band, C-band build that they're doing now. Chances are, I'm going with this, right? Uh, I think Atlanta already has millimeter wave getting built out. I'm not sure about its distribution. Uh, but C-band has been a hot topic for Atlanta. Let's see what this is exactly. More than 1 million customers in Atlanta, Georgia, now have access to higher speeds and greater capacity from Verizon's award-winning 5G ultra-wideband network. Verizon's high-performance 5G ultra-wideband provides game-changing benefits, 10 times the download speed and median upload speed and faster than LTE and all that great stuff, all the things you could do, gaming and video chatting. Anyways, it... Give some examples of cities where you can find it. Loganville, Lawrenceville, Kennesaw, McDonough, Mc, McDonough, I don't know, Hiram, and Milton, Georgia. The service also covers portions of southwestern Forsyth County, southeastern Fulton, north Fulton, western Clayton, southeastern Cherokee County, and Hartsfield Jackson International Airport. All right, so that's a lot of new additions. Remember, Atlanta was left out of the initial top 46 PA rollout, even though it's definitely a big market. And they had to get clearance from satellite operators to do that. Verizon paid the cost, had them accelerate that repack from satellite operations to cellular. And I think that's where we are here. It says additional customers in Atlanta have access to Verizon's 5G ultra wideband service 18 months earlier than projected due to agreements with satellite operators to clear C-band spectrum. All right, so there it is. If they didn't repack this quickly and pay to accelerate the repack, uh, it would have launched in December of 2023. Clearly, they needed that capacity, and Verizon made it happen. Uh, that's one thing you could definitely count Verizon in on. They they paid a lot of money for the spectrum. They want to get it out. Atlanta is the type of market where you don't really want to be sitting on this if you ha if you don't have to. I can't blame them for trying to address the issue. They have a lot of customers in Atlanta, and they, they got to create that capacity. You can do it with millimeter wave, uh, but to get accelerated reach, you, you're you definitely going to want to do it with mid band too, right? That's the primary purpose of the 3.7 and 77 C band is it's the Goldilocks 5G spectrum, right? Nice and high with deep bandwidth, wide channels, and uh, just low enough frequency with lots of power. You can really push it out there and get some reach. All right. Now remember your plans. You got to have an up-to-date plan. So that's a 5G get more, play more, or do more. Uh, or you got to pay for that add-on, which I think is like $10 a month. So you can't do it with the start, and you can't do it with those welcome unlimiteds. So there you go. You and, and now I think they might also be able to offer the home internet in these places for those that might qualify. And it's, you know, they're check for your address online to see if you are supported in your area. And I think... Um, Goes on to talk about like frontline first response teams and all that. Anyways, uh, if you're in the Atlanta area, good for you. Enjoy the service. I hope it reaches more places faster and sooner. Comment down below your thoughts and opinions on this. You all the voice of the people, the SMT Nation. Let your voice be heard. Like, share, subscribe for more. And turn on that bell notification icon to never miss an upload from the SMT. Check out the links in the description box. Business inquiries to the Gmail address down below. My Patreon page, if you want to support us and get early access to content and exclusive videos not found anywhere else, including podcasts and live streams. My Twitter handle down there as well. Thanks for watching. See you on the next one. Peace.